Massa Burn here, coming 101, and I'm late, but not too, too late, if you know what I mean. So, why well, I suppose do it right now, right? The reason why I'm saying that, <coughs> saying that, because I was supposed to get a second one to open it, so I have it out on the, you know, on my thing over here. But, too late, because they tore them all down, and now I'd only have one. And I'm going to keep them in this package because, well, this is the last of the Rise of Ninja Turtles. This is supposed to be the Shredder. And I did find another one. If you saw my um, video where I'm at Walmart and Target, all his head just comes right off. So I was like, dang, I don't know if they broke it or you could fix it, but whatnot. Um... As you could tell, the guy who created or helped make the Rise of Ninja Turtles is uh, Samuel Jacks. And remember um, that big ass demon that he was trying to fight? Well, look, it, he changed. He actually, that's all it is, is that demon from that show and trying to make it look like Shredder, but it's just that. Um. So um, I hope, and they said they actually have a new artist, a new writer, which I'm hoping is going to be good. Better than the Rise against against the Ninja Turtles or Rise of the Ninja Turtles, whatever. But um, there's hooks right there. So yeah, I was oh, I made it just. Just in time to, before they knock, tore him down. That's what it's supposed to look like. That's supposed to be Shredder. There you go. Read that if you want. See, it's just the same thing. The guy took one of his characters from Samai Jack, or whatever it's called, and brought it in this. Now, the one I really wish I had, and they never once brought it out, was this the rare Donatello with the jet. Rare spider shell. I was trying to hope to get those, but those never made it out, as far as I know. And I don't care for this wrestling Don King Michelangelo and Bug Buster Lee and Raph. Of course, they're not going to make the other two, which is I hate when they do stuff like that. Wrestling Leo, that's all you get with the wrestling Mike. Ooh, where's the rest of them? The star shell turtles was pretty good. The allies, which I was confused about, like. I saw him. I didn't want to get him because I thought he looks kind of dumb. But I should have got him. Especially the hippopotamus. I got everything else. Except for that guy. I don't know. I think they need to bring Brandon back. Who did the Ninja Turtles 2012 ones. I mean that guy was a true. True Ninja Turtles fan. And he knew what he was doing. Storyline was great. The artwork was great, and he, like I said, he knew a lot of the old school stuff, and he kept it old school. And that's wish I, oh, I wish they brought him back, that writer and his partner. But this is, like I said, this is one of the last of the rise of the Team NT. Sucks because I will hope I was kind of hoping to get the last shredder, but. Not only I, now I'm just going to keep them in the box. Unless I go to the thrift store or collector places and they actually sell this, i probably get a one for open. I'll probably do this video all over again. All right, guys. So put your comments down. Tell me what you guys think about this shredder right here. Like I said, it's not technically a shredder. It's just that demon from Samuel Jack. That's all it is. Just repainted and everything. Seriously, look it up. I'm not kidding. That's all it is. So, 2019, and they took them all off the shelf, unless you go to uh, Big Lots. They usually do that, keep the leftover ones, or collector stores. But, um, yeah, I just want to share this with you guys. So, um, I guess I uh, finally did a toy review. It's been, like, how many, how many months now? All right, to be continued, guys, and uh, happy hunting, everyone. Laters.